three explosions and three bombers. This according to Turkish state television. So this was three men, three bombs, presumably also three uh, automatic weapons which were used to kill as many people as possible before the bombers then detonated themselves. We still don't have a firm grip on exactly where the explosions took place. Uh, we heard uh, earlier that one took place outside of the international departures area where, of course, you do get a line of people who are waiting to be screened. We've heard a report that one of them was in the parking lot. We don't yet know where the third bombing was. But certainly, this appears to be a coordinated attack with deadly effects. FAA just telling me that they've halted all U.S. flights to and from the airport there in Istanbul. Unclear when that will change, uh, but of course this is all in response to the explosions uh, that happened there at that airport. Uh, the FAA will do this, and they are doing this sort of thing to ensure safety of passengers. They do this from time to time uh, when there is instability security-wise, and that's what we're seeing playing out here today. Again, all flights to and from the U.S., between the U.S., I should say, and Istanbul have been halted, uh, and that is at the call of the FAA.